I felt like on this problem set that this was probably the most difficult of all the questions because I missed something myself. I had to solve it like three times before I figured it out. But anyways, you're still going to use the equation. The, the spring equation is 1 half kx squared. But you're going to have it twice, right? So you've got for, one for the athlete and one for the non-athlete. So you're going to do this equals 1 half kx squared. And then you're going to find it each of them and then subtract. Now, warning, you've got crazy weird units going on, right? And so if you look at the spring constant is 33 newtons per one millimeters. You're going to want to convert that to newtons per meter. And then you have to convert the x's to meters. They're both in millimeters. I first thought that if you they would cancel out, and they didn't. Um, anyways, didn't work. So what I would encourage you to do is solve for yeah, everything into the appropriate meter units. Plug it in, get this number, the athlete joules, and then the non-athlete joules with their different knees or whatever, and then you will subtract these two numbers to get your answer.